Hey there, everybody. Welcome back. I am the Gerbil, and I come to you today with um, just a cautionary tale and a piece of advice and to help you be aware of uh, unwritten terms and conditions that may apply to some of your guild gift giving initiatives. So take this bundle right here, 40% more crystals in the Crate of Crystals March Madness deal, $50 not available for self-purchase. Mm. It's only available, it seems, if you gift it. Cool. So what does that mean? It means you go to Discord and you're like, hey, guild friends, guild friends, I want to get this bundle. Um, will anyone buy it for me and I will reciprocate or get you something else that you want? My good buddy, Ultimate Jedi there, was like, I'm here for you, bro. It's a good deal. So he bought it for me. I went to my game and I'm like, score, I got what I wanted. And then, then the weirdness happened. So then I went to my store and I was just curious. Here it is. See, it's, it's not available here. There's fifty dollars, seven thousand. Ah, there it is. Gifts. So I go to my guild gift store to reciprocate, and I click on it, and then it's like find the guild member you want to give it to. I'm looking at it. Okay, there. And I'm scrolling. I'm scrolling, and he's at the very bottom, and it says ineligible. Why is that? It turns out that it is limit one per recipient. And it does not say that on the thumbnail. It does not say that when you click on it and load it, there is nothing there that says limit one per recipient, which th this before you say, yeah, but no, no, no. Imagine you walk into Walmart. Like, imagine you get in your car and you drive across town and you, you park and you go into Walmart. That is the time you spent to get on Discord and type up your message and negotiate with people. Time spent. Then you get to the store, you get to Walmart and you're like, ah, there's the, I don't know, vacuum cleaner that somebody wanted or the groceries or the whatever doesn't matter. There's the jewelry, the shirt, the hat, the, the gift bundle. And the store clerk is like, Oh no, sorry. Sorry. Grandma already got that. So I cannot allow you to buy it. It's like, well, what if grandma wanted to, well, grandma ain't getting to, and neither is your guild mate. This is just, this is really, really nasty that it's in there. It, it by not saying limit one per recipient by unless you click on it and scroll through your list of guildmates, you don't know necessarily who has received it or who has made an agreement with somebody else to receive it. And then you go post your message and you wait for somebody to respond and you negotiate for that reciprocal deal. And in the meantime, somebody says, yeah, sure. They buy it for you. And then maybe somebody else gifts it before you do or maybe they made multiple agreements, first come, first serve. Well, guess what? Everyone who buys it after the first can't buy it. Everyone who tries to buy it after the first cannot. So then I went back to, to my guild mate ultimate and I was like, hey man, I, I, uh, I was like, uh, Rutro Scooby-Doo, we got a problem. What do I do? And he's like, don't worry, you owe me. <laughs> and I don't mind. I, I will pay him back at some point. But I don't like having that feeling lingering over me, right? That that somebody bought me a $50 gift bundle that I can't reciprocate immediately for. And that's because he and another guild mate, AJ, had already done the same deal. AJ bought Ultimate, Ultimate bought AJ. Then Ultimate said, yeah, I'll make the same deal with you. And then I went to buy it and nope, no, locked out, can't do it, sorry. So I received, but I can't give back, right? Nobody likes that feeling. I mean, you know, you go to you go out to a bar or a restaurant and your friend's like, hey, let me buy you a drink. You're like, yeah, sure, man. Next time you go out, you want to do the same for them. But now it would be like the bartender saying, no, 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 because two days ago, somebody else bought him a, 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 a beverage. Somebody else bought him a white Russian, a margarita, a martini, a bud, a, a whatever. Take your pick, a Heineken. You cannot buy it for him, sir, because someone else did two days ago. Come on, CG. This is not cool. 
it, it, and and anyway, I just wanted to share that and hope that you all don't fall victim to the same thing. When you negotiate a deal for a discount bundle promo package, similar to the Lightspeed bundles, make sure if you and your guildmate are trying to reciprocate do, uh, deals for each other, that you got a backup plan or that nobody else has already bought it for them, which just makes the whole system even more complicated. I mean, who wants to be like, I'm gonna go buy something for you, bro, but before I do, hang on, I gotta, I gotta make a few phone calls, I gotta check with 48 other people and make sure no one bought it for you. Well, hell, if CG's gonna do that, why not just give us a dang gift registry? Like, that. anyway, whatever, I'm venting. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. You definitely don't have to like and sub for this video, but if you did enjoy it, hit the like, hit the sub, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.